I'm here to blow your mind once again. You're never gonna understand that crazy. Well, we made rice refills free like you suggested, and now we have way more customers. Is that right? Puts my mind at ease. Well, that's still not enough. They're gonna swallow. Uh, drop your prices. Kind of as pricey, pretty pricey as it is. So a price drop on your end should help your place stand out. You'll be the other option. Wow, really know your stuff. Wow, I've never thought of the idea of dropping prices to compete in capitalism. What the fuck is wrong with him? <laughs> like, what the fuck? Why is he... Has he... Has, was he born yesterday? It's genuinely confusing. I'm just like... I'm giving him like a 10 year old's like pro tips on capitalism and it's revolutionizing his business. I haven't seen you in a bit. Yo. Yagami-shi, kondo wa nan desu ka na? Amari ooki na koe jia ienai nda kedo sa, tochou ki ga hoshin da. つくもそういうの詳しくない。詳しいに決まってるでしょ。僕を誰だと思ってるんですか。だよな。材料さえ揃えばすぐ作れますぞ。材料ってお前の手作り。メイドインつくもこれ以上信頼できる製品はありません
Okay. I am not well at the moment. Wow, those are weirdly powerful, actually. Like, almost confusingly so. Nope. There we go. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, oh. Hacker drops harder than I remember. The timing is something I can't seem to remember how to do. Which is a bit of a problem. No, I just finished a fight, man. I feel like the density of fights has gone through the roof in this game. It's weird. Quick dialogue. Well, we made the prices cheaper like you suggested, and now we have many more customers. But that's still not enough at this rate. Connor's not going to swallow you whole, okay? All you have to do is showcase something original. Which you do have, yes? If we did, I would have said so earlier. And ordering a brand new item out of the blue would only drive up costs. Okay, so scratch the idea. Maybe if you can focus on the way you grill or feature some kind of special sauce. Honestly, our grills are nothing out of the norm. And our sauce is just my grandma's old recipe. Huh? Huh? Can you repeat that last bit? Honestly, our grills are nothing out of the norm and our sauce is just our grandma's old recipe. That, that's it. Kim son, is your sauce still made the same way as your grandma's? Yes, sir. We always use my grandma's sauce when eating yakiniku. Balance between soy sauce and mirin topped with a gentle dollop of honey is what does it. And that's it. What you described to me just now is your original mouth-watering secret sauce. Ah, I see where you're going with this. Brilliant. Then I'll advertise it just like that. He just realized that he can advertise the unique sauce. Family-friendly yakiniku served with secret sauce, a traditional recipe from Kim San's grandma. I think this is our best idea yet. And they don't even change anything, they're just advertising what they're already making. Go figure. He just vanished, by the way. Is he back here? I can't go that way. I still can't eat here, by the way. Like, I think I need to finish the entire quest chain just to get the ability to eat here. Which is a little strange. Maybe they just want to make the last store really hard to access or something. Whoa. The friendship icon is vanished. How could such a thing occur? No, 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 no. Wait, it's just one guy. What the hell? Just one lonely dude being completely alone. What a plan he's got. You want to go? You want to freaking go? Wow. What a fight. That guy's like, why did I show up? Why am I here? He tried to do a, a long jump like he was jumping off a, a roof, but it was just a small, t a small sign. Have I met new people yet? Nope. Gotta meet more people, which is surprising because I've met a lot of people. Like, I'm running out of people. And yet... I swear to God! This is exhausting! Go away! Come up with anything else to do with your time. Uh, I, can't, I can't even call the, my potential date because I gotta fight you guys. fight over? No, it's not. I've got a golf club. Time to work on my swing. And fatality.
What? <laughs> There's the slow motion takedown followed by the awkward ragdoll every time. It always looks incredible. Is he back yet? <gasps> He's back! Have I completed the beef recipe? No, 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 no. It's gotta be like a make them stop mode at some point, because this is so overkill. Yagami-san, we did it! My grandmother's Jakaniko sauce is becoming a huge hit! We've been getting customers left and right ever since. Business is booming now. Eh? Of course. You pulled out all the stops to make it happen. <laughs> well, we couldn't have done it without your superb advice. You have my thanks, Yagami-san. <laughs> ah, I didn't do much. Thank your grandma instead. Yes, I should. Thanks, grandma. <laughs> this sauce, it's delicious. What could possibly be in it? Hmm? Wait, is that the manager of Kanrai? I heard beef sewn sauce was the talk of the town, so I had to know I had to try it out myself. But this is beyond my expectations. We'll have to try even harder just to keep up with you, huh? <laughs> oh no, we're really nothing special. Nonsense. If we don't improve our own sauce, all our customers are gonna end up eating here instead. I'm not so sure about that, but it's quite flattering to hear from such an esteemed business as Kanrai. Well then, I'll better take my leave. Let's do our best from here on out, hmm? Yes, and thank you for entering the beef zone. <laughs> Can't get over that name. Yagami-san, did you hear that just now? <laughs> yeah, he really talked you up there, didn't he? He sure did. I got the feeling he was really impressed, so I'm all fired up now. Thank you so much, Yagami-san. Uh... It's something any fan would do. Keep that fire alive, Kim-san. Oh, and by the way, as thanks, I'd like to let you eat here as a special discount price. You mean it? Of course. You can come by here and fill up any time. I'll make it cheap. Sounds good to me. I appreciate that. My pleasure. Concerted bonus for the, from the beef zone. Will do. Now that I've completely revamped your entire goddamn restaurant, maybe now I'm allowed to eat here. He made that- he's- oh my god. I can't get- I'm getting too many messages from the same person. Leave- make that- stop. Stop. <laughs> yes. Now I've completed every food menu in the entire game except maybe that one bar. Is that one bar done yet? Because it's, it's hard to tell. Because you, you, unlike food, I cap out on alcohol. Look at all these stars. Yep, Earth Angel. Nope. Still got still have five more drinks to order at, at Earth Angel. At some point. But otherwise, we've done it. Ha 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 ha. No, stop. They're everywhere. We're not even in con we're not even in Kensai gang mode right now. We're 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 in post gang mode and they're still everywhere. Like the 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 con the Kaihen or Kensai, whatever they are. Like they're supposed to attack on the kingdom. All it really does is generate a bunch of units. There we go. Most, most. Yes. We are ready to proceed with the story. I instantly gained 200 uh, experience. SP. Hello, Earth Angel. Still working on this. Wow. You get capped out fast. Oops. Yup. 
That's why I haven't finished it yet. You can only drink like two things at a time. And then you're just devastated. <laughs> Come on. You can do it. Poor devastated liver. Yagami. Yep. 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 I'm an adult. <laughs> I'm glad that there are now taxi routes that take you to the middle of the of the neighborhood. I never wanted to use taxis before in the other games because I, I, if I remember correctly, they were they would only take you to the perimeters of the neighborhood. So like you'd have to run towards the wall of the neighborhood, which you would usually had no reason to be at anyway. Then you'd te to teleport to a different wall of the neighborhood, then run into the core of the neighborhood again. Whereas now, if I'm near a wall, I can teleport to an area in the middle of the area of the neighborhood that's much closer to my actual goal half the time. So I'm way more likely to use it now. Well,ヤガミ氏、早かったですね。お前の仕事の早さには負けるよ。ふふ、お褒めに預かり光栄ですぞ。では、商品をどうぞ。コンセントに差し込み、偽装するタイプのものです。受信範囲は 100m、たとえヤガミ氏のような名探偵であろうと、この盗聴器を見破ることは困難でしょうね。なんか一言余計だな。まあ、でもサンキュー。助かったよ。どういたしまして。I <笑> agree. I don't think that is particularly true. Yagami's not a great detective. <laughs> All of his victories pretty much fall into his lap. One of my biggest pieces of information was that when that guy... I fought my way through that entire uh, Yakuza... Like, hideout. Just to have the guy in the wheelchair come out and just explain half the plot to me. Unprompted, practically. And like... Several of the, the things I do are just me asking people like Tsukumo to do all the work for me. And like... Do trace stuff because Yagami can't understand the idea of searching keywords on Twitter, so he needs Sukumo to do it. And he's like, Wow, what a magical hacking man! And I'm like, He's just doing a keyword search, I can do that. It's really easy. <laughs> like, it's really those, some of those moments are strange. And like, he's he, he learns very little throughout the case, and you know, it's all pretty much information that somebody just expo like exposits directly to him. He hasn't really shown me any, like, cool Sherlock moments of like, Wow, he really pulled that off. Look at that crazy, clever shit he came up with. I'm so impressed. He's just... trying, mostly. Hello. <laughs> まつがね組に盗聴器仕掛けろって話だよね。もう話は聞いたんだな。そう。じゃあ杉浦君、説明してあげて。あのね、悪いけど無理。こっそり忍び込めったって組事務所じゃずっと留守番いるでしょ。出
確か松金組のおおよ組一番のおしゃれ大好き田代君だ夜だろうがグラサンを外さねえところでこいつはターボーと似たような体格でな俺に似たような体格ってまさかもしこの田代君がマスクでもしたら中身がすり替わったって誰も気づかねえよなうんきっと気づかねえよなグッドアイデアだねはあじゃあこの田代君に変装して潜れってうんまずはやつを見つけてジャージとサングラス一式を拝借あとは簡単だ堂々と事務所に入って盗聴器を仕掛けまくるなんだよ結局俺がやんのかよろしくお願いしますまあでも<笑>だいぶ頭使ったな海藤さんほらいつか松金組に戻る日があるかもしれねえって今日までそう思ってたんなんだよ急にでもよ親父に面と向かって逆らったんじゃもう無理だあそこまでしたからには<笑>もうとことんやるまでよだろそっかよしじゃあ田代君の身ぐるみ剥いでくっか I'm going to find him and I'm going to strip him <laughs> um who doesn't like food mmm meat and potato stew it's a chow time I'm just gonna watch I'm just gonna eat it while I watch maintaining contact eye, eye contact the entire time as they lose their minds Yeah, did I stutter? He never takes his shades off, which is how we're going to disguise ourselves as him. Ah, Kaito san. Huh? Tashiro kun no ibasho, ate wa nai no? So da na. Aitsu ma kyabakura no shinogi o yatte ta kara, so ko ni araware ru kamo shiren na. Kyabakura? Doko no? Tashi ka, Emerald Hills ってなまえだ七福通り西のよしじゃあまずそこに行ってみるか Right back into another cabaret club, huh? Huh We're nothing if not, if not consistent, I suppose I'll take it Sorry ma'am, this isn't a mugging, I'm just an idiot There he is He says the I always thought I'd make it went back into the Yakuza, but now I've defied the boss. Yeah, but he's like the boss you guys have a special bond with and everything. If you can find a way to remove this, out, this outside influence and this guy that's like taking control of the entire family lately, then maybe you can actually just get back in the good graces at that point. It seems like a real problem that the guy who isn't even the patriarch is taking over the entire family. That's a problem for everyone. Sumimasan, chotte. Irashayose, of Tari Sama de Shoka. Yeah, as we nikitan janakte. Kogo Matsugane Gumiga Ketsumotter Misedaro. Eh, Sorega Nanika. Hito Sagasher Nagado Tashiro de Hito Shirana Tashiro. Hora, it's Mohadena Jaji Kitte, sir. 夜でもグラサンしてるやつだよわかるだろあ<笑>あの人そうそうそいつだよ知ってるじゃねえかどこにいるかわかるあ<笑>さっきまでここにいたんですけどねちょっと面倒なお客がいましてその人連れてどこか行っちゃいました焼き入れかまあいつにはぴったりの仕事だなどこに連れて行った多分天下一通りの方ですビルの裏手にあまり人が来ない空き地があるとかで<笑>そのくらいの知恵は働くってわけか焼き入れんなら人気のない場所ってのは鉄則だ何偉そうに言ってんのよっしゃ行ってみようぜターボーああ助かったよい,いえ
Talking from experience? Yeah. Remember your history of getting beaten up by, by Kaito in Dark Alleys? Because you guys... We discovered that about you guys. That's the backstory back in the day. Yagami kept picking fights with Kaito over and over again until apparently the uh, Patriarch decided to step in and got all interested in that. Now we're going back where we came from, basically. <laughs> I do kind of miss food being an experience source. And that whole back and forth of like fighting, giving you your food meter back. Just because this other system where it's only a way of healing feels like a less interesting mechanic. Than what it used to be. Oh, the, is the alley with the bad reputation the one for that behind Kiri's bar? Or Kiri's friend's bar? Oh, that was short-lived. That was really a Yakuza Zero thing. A location giving more, given more meaning by the prequel. あの、なおさ。うちにさ、おさわり現金なんだよ。君の的の顔ぐらいは分かってんだ。うるせえ。あの、私はこれで。ま、ちゃれ。くそ。お前のせいで逃げられたじゃねえか。どうせ変な因縁つけて金巻き上げようとしてただけだろ。あの客が本当
よろしくタボ下手打つんじゃねえぞ大丈夫だってタシヒロクンスタイル I mean, that's the best disguise I've seen him use so far, actually. I look absurd. Just completely absurd. Exquisite screw. <laughs> I have a screw attack logo on the back. Oh my god. I mean, all the other Yagami costumes except for the vampire just make him look like Yagami with different clothes, which makes them not even really disguises. So, kudos. This one actually looks like a disguise.